Today I'm going to be taking this chicken yard and we're going to be expanding it because right now the chicken yard is just absolutely a mess and there's not enough space for our chickens to be able to actually get around and eat and do all the other fun stuff. So follow along to see us transform the yard and make it a little bigger. <laughs> so first what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to cut my path here so that we have a clean spot to follow. So I'll go ahead and cut a line along this old manger here and we're going to set it up so that we can get nice and close to the manger without actually nailing into it. And how we're going to do that is we're going to use this bad boy. And this right here is the Yard Force 22 inch cutting swath and it's an absolute beast making these big jobs or bigger areas if you're not using a, a sit mow or a push mow to just absolutely obliterate stuff. So let's go ahead and dive into it. So we won't do the whole entire area. We're gonna leave a little bit for the chickens to scratch down like back in that corner right there. But beyond that, this at least gives us a straight line that we can follow. But most importantly, uh, we can see the ground. I think that's the biggest thing is that we'll actually be able to see the ground and see how deep we're going with the actual chicken wire or the chicken fence and uh, keep them safe from predators. The next step is pretty simple. We're gonna dig a hole that follows this post. We can use the old fence as like an actual gate. So we can still close them in if we ever wanted to leave them in the old yard, but they still have full access to this new yard that we're expanding to. The big old rock, that's what that sound is. All right, we've already run into an issue. We keep hitting a huge stone over here, so I'm gonna see if I can just skim past it with one of these old posts instead and just kind of post pound around it. And instead of putting in one of those old school wooden posts, so. And so we're gonna pound about two or three more down that way for the integrity of the fence. And we'll just keep moving from there. <laughs> that wasn't that cool. <laughs> Now comes the fun part. We're gonna start to lay out the wire, the fence. We're gonna roll the fence out. <laughs> We're gonna use these simple poultry net staples. Work really good in these situations in wooden posts, especially with fences. All right, now that I got the finger masher out of the way, I'm gonna start weaving these loose wires around each other. Look at that, got pretty solid on that part. And now we're just gonna tighten this down, work our way to the next spot. Let's keep going. Now the easiest way I can think of to wrap this post would be to use zip ties. Good old zip ties. <laughs> Officially trapped myself in here, so I'm gonna be working on the next part, which is letting the chickens out. And then later on, I'll come back and I will stake the bottom parts of the fence in and then finish strapping them down all the way up and down each post. So it should be pretty fun, pretty quick. Here goes Araya. Uh huh. She's doing it. Uh huh. Go, girl. Cut, cut those chains. Cut those fence links. Yeah. Come on, girl. Yeah. Awesome job. Woo! Look at that, Ryan. You did that. You cut that fence. High five. All right, girl. Feel proud of yourself? Now we got to put it back together with a new fence. <laughs> now we've got the fence pretty much ran the whole way down, and so now they will be locked in in here. The only thing left to do is to make sure that we pound the bottom of the fence in with some floor stakes or ground stakes, whatever they call them. The wife was able to get some landscaping pins, so not the most intense or durable, but it'll get the job done. So we're just gonna stake around the fences here, and we're gonna keep going. All right, we were able to get the chicken yard expanded, so here's the original chicken yard. We pulled out a whole bunch of stuff, and then we made a little gate here, a little fence opening, where we were able to create a whole space for them. So now they've got this whole area, plus that area over there, plus their original chicken yard, and they're all fenced in and should be good when it comes to predators. All the low areas at least are filled in. So, <sighs> took us a minute, but we finally got there. Uh, let us know in the comment section if you have any questions about what we used or how we did it. But so far, I mean, it was pretty straightforward. And you saw the chickens. They, you see them right now. They're super happy and uh, excited to have the new space. I can tell you this right now, there's way less fights. Thanks for watching our video. Join us next time on another episode of our family fun adventures. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. We try to post every two to three weeks. Aloha.